Okay, forces. So, we're going to learn four types of forces. Okay, the first one is normal force. So, what is normal force? Normal force is force that perpendicular to the contact surface. So again, contact surface means if there is no contact, no normal force. So we have this is surface. Let's say this is an object. So perpendicular. This is normal force. This is the contact surface perpendicular. So this is normal force. Okay, then we have weight W equal to mg. So what is weight? Weight is the force due to gravitational acceleration. Always, if I can use the word, vertically downwards. So we have a situation like this. This is the object. Weight is vertically downwards. Even in inclined plane, it's not like this. It should be vertically downwards. So that is weight. Okay, then we have friction. Little f. So, what is friction? Friction is force that resists the motion of an object. So, if the object moving to the right, so friction to the left. Oppose. Okay. We have f equal to mu n. Okay, one more we have is tension. So tension is force that pulls in or by stretched string or rope or anything. Okay, again we have stretch. So if it's not stretched, so we don't have tension. So tension always directed away from the object. Okay, let's say we have three object. This is a pulley. So we are going to draw the tension. Tension always directed away. So for this object directed away, this object directed away. So directed away from this object and this one directed away from the object. Okay, now if I can label, let's say this is T1, T2, T3, T4. So the rule is same rope. Okay, you have same tension or string. Same tension. Okay, in this case, you can see T1 equal to T2 and T3 equal to T4 same rope same rope but T1 is not equal to T3 already separated by this object okay so the same goes to T1 is not equal to T4 because separated by something else okay so that is the concept of tension